Hey guys, so right now I'm at Ulta and my boyfriend gave me a little budget, a uh, hundred dollars. I'm probably not gonna spend a whole hundred dollars though, but yeah. I'm gonna show you guys what I get. So right now, so I found this one finally because it's literally been sold out everywhere. Um, so yeah, that's all that I got. I'm gonna stay with it though. Hey guys, so I was gonna give you guys a little haul of what I got because I'm back from Ulta. I'm just parked up, you know what I mean? So, but I have nowhere to set you guys up. Like, literally, I have nowhere to set you guys up. So, I'm just going to do a little haul when I get home. And basically, what this video was about is I really didn't explain myself that much. But basically, my boyfriend gave me 100 bucks, And he said, like, here, like, spend it on whatever you want, you know? So, yeah, he gave me, like, a $100 budget. And I got a lot of good stuff, you guys. <laughs> Dude. I'm like, damn, I literally spent that much. <laughs> but it's worth it. And I'm also gonna do like a, how you say it? Like, I'm gonna give you guys like, hold up. Okay, so I'm gonna test out all the products when I'm home and stuff. I'm gonna do a full face of like what I got and stuff. So hopefully everything is good i also got shade matched um, my concealer and foundation so i'm pretty sure like i'm not gonna have to return those because she literally like shade matched me and she tried it on on me and it looked really good so i'm probably not gonna have to return that but mm, yeah so i'll see you guys at home bye guys so i'm finally back home and i'm gonna give you guys a little haul of what i got from ulta so the first thing that I got was this e.l.f. Um, primer. I have the blue one, but I want to try out the pink one because it's pink and I love pink. And then I got these Truly um, Star Pimple Patches because I was running out for real. And then I also got this Essence Brighten Up Banana Powder. Um, yeah, because I want to brighten up like my under eyes more. And then I got this powder. This one's like my shade. So, yeah. And this is in the shade 230. And then I also got this L'Oreal Infatible Foundation. Alright okay, guys. Um, but yeah, I got this L'Oreal Infatible Foundation. And this is in the shade 430. Then I got this Too Faced um, Concealer. And this is in the shade Pearl. So happy i got this i've been wanting it so yeah and i'm gonna tell you guys the total you guys are not ready for the total are you guys ready it's about 110 110 and 37 cents but um it's because my mom also got some things but she paid for it so that's why it's like 110 so without her things probably like 80 no It was like probably like a hundred, a hundred or like ninety five, something like that. Um, so yeah, and we're gonna do a full face of these um that I got. We're gonna see how they are. So I'm not gonna use this one because I'm gonna try out the marshmallow NYX primer, and I was gonna get it, but my mom has like a little sample one, so I'm gonna use that, and then if I like it, I'm gonna buy it. So, yes, you guys, we are back. Okay, guys, so I'm back. Um, I went to go be wet my... I can't even talk. I went to go wet my beauty blender. Um, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to moisturize our face. So, we're going to moisturize our face because you need to moisturize. Even if you have oily skin, always moisturize it, you guys. So, I'll be right back. So I'm done moisturizing my face, and this is the moisturizer that I use. I use the Pond's Dry Skin Cream. And then, now we're going to prime. This is a little sample that my mom has, so. We're just going to use a little bit because it's not mine. It's my mom's. 
Okay, that's good. So, it actually feels super, super soft. I'm not even gonna lie. So, I'll be right back. So, now we're gonna go in with the L'Oreal Infallible Foundation in the shade 430. And also, before you apply your moisturizer, no, after you apply your moisturizer, make sure to let it sit and then go in with the primer and then let the primer sit. And then, you know, because if you don't, it's not going to be good. So let me just apply this. Be right back. Okay, so I put so much, but it's okay. You're just going to let it blend. We're just going to blend it out. So I'll be right back. Actually, we're going to try a new technique, you guys. We're going to blend it in with the brush. So... <sighs> Yeah, because I've been wanting to blend it out the brush. And this is just a foundation brush. Because I heard that your base is way better when. So it's like, you know, let's just try it out. And then we could, um, how do you say it? We could apply, well, we could blend it out with the beauty blender. So. Yeah, because the Beauty Blender soaks up literally all the products. Okay, I'll be right back. And now we're going to blend it in with a brush. I mean with the brush. With the Beauty Blender. So I'll be right back when it's like done blending. Hey guys, let's just take a moment to appreciate the shade match. She literally shade matched me so good. Oh my god, I literally love her. Oh my god. I got shade matched at Ulta, by the way. So, she shade out. Blah, blah. Bitch, I can't talk. But she shade matched me so good. And look. That's how, the, that's how it looks like. Just foundation. To be honest, this foundation's pretty good. I'm not even gonna lie. It's pretty good. It's not separating nothing. And also, if your makeup is separating look at the ingredients you guys because if you're mixing water and oil it's not gonna mix well so it's gonna separate even if it's water and silicone it's gonna separate to you have to match it but silicone and oil can be um mixed just not nothing with water water based products have to be with water based products you know what i mean and then silicone silicone and then oil oil but i think you can match oil and um, oil and silicone so yeah this is how it looks like oh smooth um let's let it sit for a little bit and then apply the concealer okay so now it's done like i just let it sit for a little bit like for a minute or a few seconds so now we're gonna go in with the Too Faced born this way concealer dude i literally been wanting this concealer you guys don't even know i literally been wanting this concealer for literally the longest and i'm so happy i got it but for my under eyes we're gonna use another one so because i love my under eyes bright as fuck so let me blend this out and yes yeah, so i should have let it sit for a little bit but it's okay so i'll be right back when it's done blending this is it literally works the best you guys also guys i want to mention that texture is completely normal if you have texture that doesn't mean that your skin is cakey no it doesn't mean that but anyways i have the elf hydrating camel concealer in the shade fair beige and i'm just gonna apply it literally just under my eyes because i like having a bright under eye So yeah, I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm back. This is how the base is looking without um powder or anything. Don't mind my eyelids. I don't have product on them. But yeah, this is how. Y'all, this shit is good. Look at how smooth. <gasps> 
I'm just saying this is a good this is and it goes good with this one too the, I use it for my under eyes and it's not separating for those people that think it separates no you just have to match it up with like for me I have dry skin and I'm using water based you know I don't know if this is water based some people say it's water based some people say it's not I don't even know but it's not separating so I'm pretty sure it's water based and now we're just gonna apply the essence brighten up so let me just find my powder puff okay I'm gonna use this one just gonna apply it under the eyes oh it kind of smells good but it doesn't smell like nothing at first it smelled like something and now it doesn't smell like anything to be honest i might return this because <laughs> i don't see it does the same thing i mean yeah it's bright we're just gonna finish with the rest of my makeup and then now we're gonna use the fit me this one for the whole face but first i want to try out if this is actually actually my shade hold up okay, so i just want to try it out and see if it's actually my shade because if it's not i could literally just return it Okay. Um, it is my shade, so that's good. So let's just bake the rest of my face. Okay, so right now I'm baking, so don't mind it. I dude, I kind of fucked up on my makeup because I'm supposed to put bronzer and then bake, but you know what? It's okay. It's literally the same thing. So it doesn't matter. It's still gonna look the same. Okay, so now I'm just gonna contour my nose with the this bronzer i'm just gonna contour it like how i usually always do it i literally do the most simple contour for my nose you guys it's not difficult i just do two lines just following when i do a little circle but it's not really an, an intense like it's gonna make your nose look good but not snatched and i like my nose i just want to give it a little bit like you know like color so that's why i do that but you could also try it out um now i'm just gonna blend it with a beauty blender just little dabs okay just like that you see and now we're gonna take off this powder. we're gonna spirit. bake my nose because I, I haven't baked my nose um ooh, it's so sloppy it's okay and don't mind this nail it literally like popped off because I need a new set already. I need to make a new set right now. Just kidding. Not right now, you guys. It's not like I really need it. Okay, but anyways. We're just gonna... Apply powder to the sides like this. I'm just saying my makeup looks so fucking bomb. I'm just saying, guys. It looks super good. Hold up. Alright, guys. I gotta go do something. But, okay. Now, we're gonna take off the powder from the nose area. You wanna leave the powder that's, like, right here. You guys see that? Okay. So, we're not gonna bake no more. Yeah, we're not gonna bake no more. So, that's good. And then... Okay, sorry, I'm just kind of cleaning it up. I don't want this video to be long, but I already know this video is going to be pretty long, which... No, it's whatever. 
Okay, now we're gonna go in with the bronzer. Just gonna bronze up, you know, add color to our face. Just like that, you guys. Also, I'm gonna apply powder down here, just a little bit. Okay, anyways, so now we're gonna do this blush. The top came off. It's the Revolution blush in the shade Peach Bliss. And then some on the nose. Literally love blush, but we're gonna blend it out a little bit on this side because I did put more on this side. Okay, there we go. And now we're gonna put the highlights over your back. Okay, so the highlight that I used is I used this one um for like my cheeks, my nose, my nose bridge right here, right here, and then um this just for my inner corners and then right here. So Yes, 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 yes. I don't know what the fuck I just said. Now we're just gonna remove the powder. Sorry if this video is like so brushed when I'm doing my makeup. It's just I don't want to like I don't want this video to be that long, you know. I mean, I'm pretty sure it's gonna be long, but at this point, whatever. Okay. I'm just gonna blend um, the highlight from up here. Here, I'm just gonna apply some up here, you guys, because it kind of looks weird. I mean, it didn't really do anything. Okay, I'm gonna fix up my brows. Hold up. Okay, so now I'm gonna use the NYX lip liner in the shade brown with the NYX um, lipstick in the shade turn on so basically we're just gonna line our lips so that's just how I line my lips I don't overline them okay I'll be right back okay, so now I'm gonna use this um setting spray just the milani make it last okay we're gonna let that dry okay guys and then i'm gonna go in with the elf stay all night my girl fine setting mist by elf and we're just gonna spray okay so um we're just gonna let this dry hold up and i'll show you guys the finished results okay so this is my makeup guys i'm just saying best makeup base for reals like look at this this looks so so good oh my gosh but anyways i'm gonna check in later at the night like when i'm about to take off my makeup and i'm gonna show you guys how my makeup looks like with no touch-ups no nothing and we're gonna see how it looks like during the day so it's 11 in the night and this is how my makeup is looking um around like right here it is a little oily but that's literally like normal as fuck um i didn't touch it up the only time I touched it up was like my lips and I haven't touched it up. So yeah, this is definitely, I'm just saying, if you want your makeup to stay on the whole day, literally do it. Like my bronze are still on, my blush, everything, my highlight. Yes, it was good. But anyways, thank you guys for watching this my little youtube video um i hope you guys enjoyed make sure to click the notification bell to get notified when i post another youtube video and bye guys